Today, nuclear weapons are a major issue facing the Middle East. It is not the first time. With its back to the wall in the 1973 October war, Israel chose to brandish its own nuclear capabilities. The war erupted on Yom Kippur, the most sacred day of the Jewish year. A surprise coordinated attack by Egypt and Syria stunned Israel and pushed her to the brink of disaster. The myth of Israeli invincibility was shattered. This documentary dares to make the case that the October war could have been avoided, that the world was led to the brink of a nuclear showdown because of rigid and miscalculating politicians. We focus on 1973, the year and the war, that affected Western politics and superpower diplomacy and changed the face of the Middle East. I thought of Sadat as a character out of Aida. I didn't take him seriously. He kept making grandiloquent pronouncements and never acted on them. So I, frankly, thought he was bluffing. He wanted Israel to return to the 67 borders, in return for which Egypt would be willing to make peace, which was a big step because not no Arab state had as yet ever flatly said that they would make peace. Sadat told me that Kissinger had said, if all you have is a problem, I cannot deal with it. But if it becomes a crisis, then I can intervene. From a declassified review by the United States Intelligence Board, May 1973. Dangerous developments are expected if the UN Security Council and the Nixon-Brezhnev summit fail to construct productive decisions that Sadat considers useful. Whatever the price, whatever the sacrifice, we will not back down. We will not give up one centimeter of Arab land. This documentary will reveal secret activities that took place behind the scenes of the political arena as told by Mossad field operatives. Egyptian spies who revealed Sadat's willingness to negotiate. The Mossad's clandestine operations before and during the war. The CIA's secret dialogue with PLO leader Yasser Arafat. When Israel finally took the initiative on the battlefield, the Israeli embassy in Washington was notified. There are problems with the bear. The Russians have threatened to use force if Israel is not restrained. Nixon and Kissinger recognize an opportunity to maneuver Egypt away from Soviet influence. The great tragedies of history occur not when right confronts wrong, but when two rights face each other. The problems of the Middle East today have such a character.